So I can't stop thinking about what I saw a month or two ago when I went up to Rochester to interview Paul Travers from View 6 Corporation. You can watch that interview here. But, you know, even though it's a great product, it wasn't because of the blade and the new upgraded blade has integrated speakers and an autofocus on the camera and it's just a nice product. It wasn't that. Or because of Paul's brother, Craig, who's a championship swimmer, took some parts from some of their glasses they were making and made swim goggles, View 6 Swim, that lets you uh, keep track of what you're swimming, how many laps, and also when you're bored, you can watch YouTube, you can watch Netflix, you can watch things on it. I mean, really fascinating uh, business up there. But that's not what I keep thinking about. After the interview, when we were walking down the hall, Paul said, hey, you wanna see something? And I went in and he, he gave me these, the, the prototypes, they don't want me to show you, kind of their testing rig for, for competitive purposes. But what I was looking at was the waveguides oh, wow. for these things. See how it's floating right out in front of you? And it's both eyes. Right? Oh my gosh. It's so much different than the blade because you, you trick your eyes into thinking it's there, which does something to your brain, but this is actually it's there. Right. You could reach out and touch it. That's a, that's really nice and it's so much less distracting. Probably because it's just there. Right, isn't it comfortable? Yeah, and you don't need to look at it if you don't want to look at it. It's a much more user-friendly design, uh, not only aesthetically so that people don't know you're wearing them, but well, I guess he can explain it so much more about what's going on inside in a second. But the fact of the matter is the blade has one projector that comes down in here and it fools your eyes into thinking it's right out in front of you. These waveguides on these, on these new, new glasses that are so amazing actually have two little ones and they sync up to make it look like the image is right in front of your face. It's actually unbelievable. And there's other benefits that Paul can tell you about now. It's amazing. The displays in those glasses are 0 .1, 0 0.15 inches diagonal. They're like a grain of rice. That's how small they are. It's game changing stuff. Because it's micro LED based, you only light up the pixels you want to use too. So if you got a little arrow going to the right, you're not drawing two watts of power. You're drawing literally 10 milliwatts of power kind of a thing to put that arrow up in front of you. I mean, these glasses give you an experience like a fighter pilot might get in the cockpit of his aircraft or a high-end car with the heads up display in the windshield, but it's in the glasses now. Our waveguides, these little tiny displays, the newest CPUs that are out there, these glasses are gonna be slim and sleek. Well, maybe you can even show some folks some, a picture or two of it. But um, it is, I believe, the beginnings of the future of wearable tech. These things are gonna be game changers. I wore these around. And people can tell you're kind of wearing something, something's going on when you put them on and you know, you kind of stand out. But these other ones, when they're dialed in and they look like they do in the video, you're gonna be able to just comfortably wear them. And I've said it a thousand times and nobody believes me, but you know, reaching into your pocket to grab your phone to check something or you know, even look at your watch and scroll around on it to, to see what come, in, incoming messages there are, those days are gonna be over within five years. I'm telling you, it's gonna be as, as weird to reach into your pocket and look at your phone as dial a rotary phone. The information with 5G is just gonna to come to your face. It's gonna come right in front of you and you're gonna be able to have it. Your brain will adapt to people that are around you and situations. It'll be a seamless integration of, of data and life. And that's, that's where we're going. I'm telling you, this thing has got me up at night from what I saw. You saw the reaction in the video from me and it was, I mean, it's a game changer. It is, it is unbelievable what's gonna happen now with true AR style glasses, uh, really low on power. I'm telling you the future is here and I've seen it and uh, I'm excited about what I saw and I can't wait to get a pair of these in my hands. Yeah, that's, that's amazing.